just recently after Ben I called me and asked if I would say grace. So I said, sure. And I also got to thinking, well, let's write a poem. So I did. I fell in love again on the day that you were born. I can't really say for sure if it was night or morn. You took a piece of my heart and never let it go. But that's okay with me, you see, because I love you so. Someone else will care for you as you go on in life. That someone is Keegan. Today you are his wife. Love him and support him. Together you are great. Be there for each other now, forever your soulmate. On behalf of Keegan and Brenna, I personally would like to welcome each of you to this ceremony. You, who make up the family and valued friends of this couple, have been invited here today because you have played important roles in each of their lives. I just want to thank everybody for coming out tonight. Um, we couldn't have a better day for our ceremony and reception. We're glad to see people we haven't seen in years. Couldn't be more thankful. So, marrying the woman of my dreams. Keegan and Brenna. The joy you'll find as you pursue your shared lives together will equip you to face head on the challenges you'll encounter on this earth, and there will be challenges. On your journey together, keep your spouse in the space of highest priority in your heart. The love you share must be guarded and cherished for it is your most valuable treasure. Brenna, from the day I met you, I knew you were someone special. Even though I was scared of you, I still wanted to get to know you as we were just starting to work together. Your smile to a complete stranger showed me how kind you were, and I knew at that moment I wanted to be yours. Keegan, we both know how indecisive I can be, but if there is one decision in my life that I know is the right one, it is choosing you to spend the rest of my life with. Fast forward a few years and a few swipes later, <laughs> we were soon head over heels for each other. This was where I experienced how compassionate and loving you are. You taught me to care and trust again. You've shown me light when all I could see was darkness. Their love is honest and true. Keegan keeps Brenna sane and Brenna keeps Keegan on his toes. These two were made for each other, and I honestly believe that. I truly couldn't ask for a better person to go through life with. You have filled my life with so much joy and have shown me a kind of love I didn't even know existed. Day in and day out, I will only give you my best because you deserve all of it. I vow to be a husband that will never quit and a husband that will show you the true meaning of love. You're my best friend, my biggest supporter, and the best dog dad to think. I promise to show you for the rest of my life how much I love you. Wow. Oh my wow. Do you like it? Yeah, a lot. Wow. Very nice. Am I ready? Place your ring on Brenna's finger and repeat after me. I, Keegan, give you Brenna. I, Keegan, give you Brenna. I, Brenna, give you Keegan. 
this ring as a symbol. <laughs> this ring as a symbol. Of my enduring love and commitment. I commit the whole of my heart. And promise to cherish you for the rest of my days. And promise to cherish you for the rest of my days. Keegan and Brenna, by the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church and by the state of Iowa, I am pleased to pronounce you husband and wife, sealed together today both in law and in love before God the Father. Keegan, you may now kiss the bride. Ladies and gentlemen, I now have the honor and privilege of introducing to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Keegan and Brenna Trite. I hope you two continue to look at each other with the same love and compassion that you shared with each other today. I'd like to make a toast to the newlyweds. May you guys continue to love each other and support each other in everything that you do. Remember to always have fun, to laugh, and don't sweat the small stuff. I love you both and congratulations.